We're here with Tim Burke in Whistler a couple days before the first race. Tim, can you walk us through the last couple of weeks since Antolz? You were in Antolz training pretty hard, trying to race, score a few extra points. And what's happened since then? It's been three weeks. Yeah, Antolz definitely wasn't a focus for me. Um, as far as World Cups go, we were kind of training through those races. Of course, uh, the Olympics is, is the big goal this year. And from Antolz, I flew directly to Vancouver Island to start my preparation. It's been a few days to uh, kind of adjust to the time, relax, and recover. And from there, it's been a uh, pretty hard training camp. But I'm feeling fresh again, recovered, and I'm ready to go here on Sunday. What was Vancouver Island like? Was that condition similar to what you're seeing at Whistler Olympic Park? If anything, it was more extreme. Uh, I think it was either snowing or raining all day, every day, the entire time. We were on the island there. So it was made for some challenging training, but um, I feel well prepared. What are you looking forward to most over the next two weeks? race-wise? I can't wait to get started. You know, I think uh, this is the hardest part for me is the week before the first race, sitting around. We're not training so much now. Obviously, we're tapering back quite a bit. Um, so I have, I have a lot of energy, a lot of time sitting in the room. I want to be out there racing and uh, ready to start. Final question, how's Andrea doing these days? Yeah, Andrea's doing great. You know, she finished so strong in Antolz, and uh, I think she'll carry that momentum onto the games here, I hope. All right, good luck.